Hello Sagittarius, welcome to my channel. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'm going to be doing your tarot card reading and it's going to be focused on your love life. If you are new to my channel, welcome. So this tarot card reading is going to be looking at the current energies between you and the individual that you are dealing with. I'm going to pull a few oracle cards. Okay, so the very first card that we have is one that is talking about miracles and blessings. Everything has its gift. Now, I feel like with this particular card coming out, it is indicating that a lot of the experiences that you've been having in relation to this individual, they have been there to provide you with a sense of understanding of who you are and to, you know, make you stronger as a person. This is a very positive card. It's definitely giving you an implication of the fact that, you know, there's a lot of positive energy surrounding the situation meant to uplift you meant to you know make you into a more dynamic individual it feels like there's an element of gifts gifts that you cannot see that you are receiving as a result of this encounter that you have and share with this individual now sometimes you can go through some of the most difficult of circumstances and those are the ones that truly make you into a powerful human being So I'm definitely getting the impression of some sort of higher power having an effect upon this connection because it talks about the intelligence of the universe lying within you. So it feels as if there's an element of activation that is happening as a result of this relationship that you share with this person. Again, we're coming back to that energy of miracles and blessings. It feels like a very profound relationship, the type of relationship that can really you know, teach you about your strengths and weaknesses and allow you to have a defined understanding of who you are as a person and what you bring to the world, right? So this feels like a very big energy. It feels like a very big relationship that some of you are going through right now. You may have been opening up your eyes and looking at the world from a different perspective. Yeah, deep knowing right? So you may have known for some time that when you met this individual, this relationship was going to be very different to the other relationships that you've had with other individuals. So this feels like a very strong energy. It's talking about, you know, possibilities, activations, things that are occurring and things that you cannot see. The element of miracles and blessings is definitely something that is very hidden. Some of you may have recognized it and you may have come to understand that, you know, this relationship is going to have a big impact upon your world. So the first two cards that have come out are giving me an indication that a lot of you are starting to have impulses, you're starting to have desires or, you know, it's the type of energy that propels you to move forward. It's all about taking action. It's all about, you know, deciding to do things in your own unique way, right? So I'm feeling that from your energy alone, there's definitely something that's going on. There's definitely an energy that is propelling you forward. And you might not even know or recognize why these things are happening. But it feels as if it's related to all these other elements that have shown up.
it feels like for the longest time, you know, you've been trying to make things right. You've been trying to turn the situation around. But every time you, you know, try to come together in a happily ever after type of situation with this individual, it just feels as if things were just not falling into place. There's something about this individual's energy that is giving me the impression here that, um, you know, there's an element of frustration as well as something connected to the fact that this person is either not getting a message across or not being heard, right? It's either or. So let's begin the clarification process. For those of you that are interested in learning how to read tarot, you can check out the courses and books in the description box below. There is going to be an extended reading where we'll be looking at these energies in greater detail. Yeah. I'm sensing that the individual you're dealing with is having some sort of big tower moment, right? It feels as if they're thinking about something, but it has upset them greatly. It has shaken up their world. So I feel like in light of everything that is going on between you and the person that you're dealing with, there's an element of not being able to cope with certain movements in the energy especially for the person that you're dealing with. Yeah. There's something that's going on inside of this person. It feels as if, you know, communication is blocked. Some of you may not be receiving communication from this individual. It's not that they don't want to talk. It feels as if they can't put into words what they have to say so i feel like this individual is having a difficulty expressing themselves Picking up this energy that when things are going really well between you and this person, there can be this amazing connection between the two of you because what the two of you share with each other is a relationship that is meant to make you stronger, to make them stronger, but it feels as if something has really shaken up their world in a very big sort of way. I'm also getting the impression that every time there's a chance for the two of you to come together, there's energies that are pulling the two of you apart. Now, this doesn't feel like it's an external energy it feels like an internal energy emanating from the person that you're dealing with right so they may have a difficulty in expressing themselves during this period of time and that's because internal energies are having a very big effect upon this uh, soulmate I feel like you've been thinking about doing something for some time, right? But you haven't really been able to take action. There's something that's going on inside of your head that has uh, been on your mind for a while. Yeah, there's a lot of emotions that you feel towards this person. There's a very big pull towards their energy. And I feel like you're drawn towards them, right? So let's have a look at one more set of energies. Yeah. 
So what I see from the situation is that two people came together in this very beautiful manner with each other. It feels as if it's a connection where, you know, you found your soulmate and they found their soulmate. When the two of you were together, it feels like the ultimate form of happiness. And right now, what I'm getting is that there's a lot of frustration in the air. It feels as if this is a period of evaluation, but also feeling as if, you know, the entire connection is stagnant right now. It's just not moving forward. Now, I'm sensing as well that if things were to continue in this light, there's a, you know, potential sort of uh, hesitation to come back together because the way things are lining up, it feels as if the internal issues affecting this individual is not really allowing for either you or this individual concern to come together in the way that you would like to. So I'm going to be exploring the balance of these energies on an extended reading. I'm going to be looking at the internal energies affecting the individual you're dealing with, as well as their feelings and thoughts of the situation. It feels as if, you know, this person that you're dealing with, they're really caught in a bit of a bind. It feels as if, you know, there's elements here that they're finding very difficult to voice or express in terms of their energies. I'll also be looking at the strategy that is important for both you and this individual concern in order to move things forward. I hope you guys enjoyed your reading. Have a wonderful day and take care.